Do you wanna be like? Do you picture me like? Where will I be when I grow up? Cause I never wanna be like no. Cause they never seen me shine, nah. And I'm sorry for the me time, nah. Hey, what's up, guys? Man, it's your boy Cut TV coming to the Geek Guys video. Hey, guys, man, I tell you guys, I was gonna be trying to do my best to upload as much as I can every day if I can. And um, this is the rematch. I remember, I told you guys we played these guys twice. Um, we actually trying to set up another matchup with these guys. I got a matchup with tonight that we're actually playing. Um, I'm not gonna stream it. I'm gonna like edit it and everything and upload it for you guys. But um, like I said, this is the rematch. We're gonna play these guys twice. Uh, we're trying to set up more matches against these guys, man. Like I said, we like competition, and um, they are definitely competition. Um, shout out to them. Um, shout out to uh, Traveling, too, man. I'll put his link in the description. He's a uh, pretty good player, man. I watched him play stage the other day. Pretty good dude. Um, they got the same line. They didn't bring anybody different that time we played them. And um, all top, bro. Let me show you guys some adjustments. You know what I'm saying? Like, pretty much, like, as a content creator, as someone who watched film, bro, like, I, I, I take this serious, bro. <laughs> Let me show y'all something. Now you see right there, like wait, they're, they're switching. This is not what they did from last game. This is the last game, right? On ball defender and the hedger. And the other guy in the corner is the roll help and the on ball defender and the hedger. The hedger comes over late and green gives her greens. That's a, that happened a lot that last game. This is the last game stats right here. Alright? Last game stats. Now, that means I should have free roll. They're playing size. They switched from having a roll to having a <clears throat> a hedger and an on ball defender. It's like, all right, maybe I'll have some buckets this game. Cause last game they only gave me like ten points. They were on me. You know what I'm saying? Right there, he's a step back white. Oh my god, that crazy. Sorry, that great shot for him. Um, all top man, we're just trying to get the ball to court. Looking pretty good, you know what I'm saying? The, the normal dribble glitch. They, all, everybody was doing it. He throws the back door. Easy lob right there. Um, They definitely had it in their mind that they was not going to let Clutch go crazy this game. Um, Because remember, Clutch had, I believe, 29 points the first time. They played, 27 points, I believe it was. And come on, man. They didn't they didn't want to have that again because Clutch went stupid the first game. Clutch had, uh, I think he shot 10 for 17, 9 for 13. From three point line, so they didn't want to have that again. Um, instead, you know what I'm saying? They pretty much gave me pretty much the, the chance to be great, which is a, honestly a, a, a smart, a smart tactic. It's a smart tactic, you know what I'm saying? You don't know if the center might be, I, they don't know if I'm the weak link or not, you know what I'm saying? I could have been the weak link, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people, centers, you, you just because you, you got the easy job of just picking and rolling, you might be the weak link, you might have bad. IQ when it comes to making the extra pass, just doing smart things right there. Oh my god, he's with the crazy dot right there. He misses it. Like I said, guys, do not judge Oso right now. Trust me, Oso is one of the best shooters on a two way finisher. He's having issues with controller, so he's been breaking a little bit. But trust me, bro, like it, it kind of, I ain't gonna lie, by him missing those shots, it kind of set the tone that they were gonna play the pick and roll exactly the same way they played the game before i don't got, know if you guys watched the first game when we played these guys literally the guy in the corner on um, traveler he would literally hedge on every single role i did and try to jump the passing lane making my point guard insecure on if he should throw me the pass or not and i mean it was frustrating to deal with you know what i'm saying but trust me also's control is working better now so he's gonna definitely be able to knock down the shot somewhere i'm not we're not concerned about it at all we know we know what we got you know what i'm saying we we obviously got the best defenders on our team come on man the name of our team is defense y'all like <laughs> the name of our team is defense keep that in mind now it's looking bad already we're, we're, we're getting turnovers um it's looking shaky now um we're just fine to get the ball to court they're they're definitely on us like i said they switched from having uh they pretty much switched from having a hedger and everything to look I get the crazy lob and I dot also also miss it and somehow I swear that swung us into a bad spiral bro we're down 20 to 8 he dots him again also misses again like I said this was crazy we're losing 20 to 8 bro we never lose like this bro we're, we're down 
by 12 points is not good. It's, it's looking very shaky. And we're in a bad spot right now. Like, mentally, we're, we're messing up. You know what I'm saying? Um, and it's unfortunate, bro. Like, this is something that they did. They started doing. They had some things they did different in this game. Right there, I gave up the offensive board. I'm messing up. I said, I definitely got that stop right there. Um, this ended up being a thing in the game as well. Um, I end up messing up right here and I give up a back door like bro I was I was messing up we all had issues in the game um and that's what I'm telling you like I, I like having teammates that have a fire in them like okay <clears throat> they didn't wait to the end of the game to snap at me <laughs> you know what I'm saying let me explain this y'all like they didn't wait to the end of the game to tell me hey gas you messing up you getting no back doors like I get the big chase down block stop playing with me man like the hustle is real you know what I'm saying like let me tell you another thing, y'all. This is very important in a team atmosphere. If you're going to cry about it later, there's no reason to talk about it at all. Like, don't cry about nothing later. Address it right then and there. Like, address the issue right then and there. Right there, my boy gets them both to jump in the air. They're clapping. They're high-fiving. He's the big green. Come on, man. We're down 22 11. It's the second quarter. Remember, they had 20 points at the end of the first quarter. All right, keep that in mind now. Keep that in mind. Now, look at this, y'all. This is crazy, man. Like, right there, we're, we're playing good defense. We're, we're trying to lock up. We're trying to lock up. Somehow, he, he's, he's still, he gave it. Like I said, the problem was we gave him off of the boards this game. And you know I'm saying, like I said, we gotta learn from our, our mistakes, and we're trying to just, just pretty much get stops and get as much points as we can at this point. Cause I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's looking real shaky. Being down by double digits against the competition is never a good thing. Um, you can see the lockdowns; they're extra, extra confident right now. Um, like I said, they're playing a high low defense. They're not even playing high low; they're playing sides, which means I have the free cut. Now, if I cut. I, my, my point guard can do that, but like I said, they're hedging off Oso. They're, they're, they're not respecting Oso at all anymore. So pretty much until Oso greens a shot, I'm going to not have the roll. Um, like once I said, like the, he dots him again, Oso misses. That gives them all type of confidence to help off Oso again. Trust me, guys. Like His control is working better now, so he's going to be able to shoot. Trust me. Now. It's, it ain't no game. It, it travels. If you watching this game, bro, like... Hedge off my nigga now. I promise you, he green in that bad boy. Don't play with him. You feel me? <laughs> now look, bro. It's crazy, man. Like, um, like I said, like I, I, I'm not a hater, man. I'm actually, I support everybody who played pro M. So I'll definitely put the link to his channel in the description, um, of this video. You know, so you guys want to check him out? He streams like stage and everything. And right there, I get the offensive board, and I do a smart two-way playmaker does, man. Spots the open teammate, and he knocks down the green, man. Come on, man. Like, we got the best two two-way finishes in the game. Like, I don't care. They're not even legends, but they're better than your legends. You feel me? Like, that's how I feel. That's how we rocking. Now, right there, he docks him with the big green. Um, It's amazing. The things you'll see when you edit videos right there also hits. Oh, my God. Also hits the three off of a pass from nobody with diamond that is crazy i guess it's that that's that two-way that full breed connection they got going on i don't know what's going on but he knocks down the three you know what i'm saying if i mess up the voice over y'all gonna keep going man because it's gonna be a long video i know y'all see it 25 minutes don't judge me trust me it's, it's worth the wait it's the reason why i'm doing the voiceover for this long right there i get the board i decide not to go up with it because i'm like you know what i might mess up and Get these guys a momentum swing. Instead, I get my point guard and assist, which help his takeover go up and help his grade. You know what I'm saying? It's important that we keep his grade up because, you know, last game, he almost didn't make it. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, definitely we keep that grade up because, like, he's going against two legend locks, bro. Like, come on, these guys got, like, 30-something badges and 40 badges on defense. Like, bro, they got every single badge on something, bro. Like, they, I'm, trust me, they have every badge. Right there, he dots his teammate. His teammate, like I said, that guy before, I'm not going to lie to you, he was definitely the weak link of the of the last game. He, he couldn't knock down the shot. I sit down in the paint. I get the easy lob. Like, that's smart. That's just being smart there. There's no reason for me to move. They were already double team him. And if I came out the paint right there to help him, that was stupid. That was the reason why I stayed there so I get the easy lob. Because there was no reason for me to come back up. They're playing. They're double teaming him. Their whole game plan 
was to make sure they don't give up that nine for thirteen for a three point nine again. Trust me, they was not, they was not going for it, bro. They was, they was like, they, they was done with that. And pretty much right there, look at Oso, man. Like Oso might miss some shots, but he gonna get you some stops. You know what I'm saying, right there. I'm seeing the paint, trying to get the vert again. They get the rip. I'm like, oh man, bro, damn. We're losing 25 to 23. We're down by two points. Now keep this in mind, y'all. It was 20 to eight at the end of the second, at the end of the first quarter. You know what that means? <laughs> That's pretty good, you know what I'm saying? The name of our team is defense, you know what I'm saying? Stop playing with us. Like, we we, we, we definitely do that defense part for real, for real. Like, we, we on that, you know what I'm saying? So, keep this in mind. We only allowed five points in the second quarter, bro. Like, that's crazy. You score, you score 20 in the first, then five, then you allowed 15 points, and you only, bro, that's a W, you know what I'm saying? We'll take that all day. And now right there, Pitt, you know, we all, all was snapping at Pitt at this point. Yo, Pitt starts trying to be a playmaker. We understand, we understand you dotted that one, you dotted that one pass for everybody. Everybody pretty much, like I said, they're addressing it right then and there. We're not waiting to the end of the game to address it. You know what I'm saying? That that is what a good team would do. Instead of like, because I, I've had situations before in other games where, you know what I mean? Pretty much you cry by it later. And I address it then and there so that way it's fixed on the spot you know what i'm saying that's that's good stuff right there and i'll say this right there uh i feel like everybody on our team has thick skin pretty much like we can you can criticize something i do right there on the spot instead of me getting mad and taking all personal like oh fuck y'all blah blah i'm trying to say chris but like f y'all blah blah you know nah I take it as a man, like you know what? He right. Let me make an adjustment. That's what a good teammate does. He ain't gonna wait till after the game to talk behind my back. Nah, that's corny, bro. Address it right then and there. Let's work on it now. You feel me? So that's what we've been doing. And I, I like the team, bro. Everybody been on point, bro. Like we just making everybody just. You know what I'm saying everybody got each other back. You know what I'm saying like, oh, so no, if you miss shots, bro, we got it back. Nobody gonna talk crap about them. Whatever, we good. You know what I'm saying? I see in the paint right here. I know I had the lob, but they're, they're chasing at the. They're chasing at them. Easy live right there. I have 12 points. Remember the whole last game, I had 10 points. They were on me. The adjustment was pretty much that they did not want to let Clutch go stupid again. I don't blame them. Clutch was a monster last game, and I wouldn't want him to score that much either. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? So that's the same way I play. I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I let the center be great that when I'm playing lockdown. The lockdown's gonna definitely have to. Ooh, come on, bro. Come on, come on, y'all. Come on. Come on, 14 points. I remember, I had 10 points all last game. <clears throat> like I said, they switched their defense. You know what I'm saying? That's the thing you see before. It's right there. He, we try to double team him in the paint, and he dodged the hash. I'm just saying, he has good pro in IQ. Now, the reason why we skip, we're advancing this this game. Uh, um, like I said, if I mess up, I stutter a little bit on the voiceover. We not gonna, we not gonna go back over. It, man. We just gonna, we gonna leave it raw like this. And we're gonna just talk to y'all the whole game. All right, look, remember, this game was actually like 39 minutes long. I trimmed it down to 25 minutes. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, 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 I'm doing this all a favor. I'm, I'm, I'm fast forwarding as much as I can. But we're at the fourth quarter. We're at the crucial time. I don't want to fast forward no more because this game got really crazy. You know what I'm saying? So right here, we're losing 44 to 41. Um, the game is still in crucial moments. We're still trying to make it get stops right there. Come on, bro. They messed up right there. They didn't play sides again. They went straight to high low. And come on, man. You, you can't do that with Clutch, bro. Clutch is a green machine right there. Like, he's a big shot right there. And like I said, they switched their whole defense. Look at, look at Oso with the on ball still. Oso goes up in the paint, gets the dunk. Like, come on. That's what I'm saying. Say, guys. Like, we trying to tell Oso, bro, get out your head. You're missing shots, so what, bro? You're making stops, though, bro. Like, the point guard is not having fun going against you. Like, trust me, bro, he probably hates you right now. I would hate you. You're going stupid. Like, chill. You know what I'm saying? You got pretty much, you got to be that moral support for your teammates, bro. Like, when they're in their head, you got to be that person to help them get out their head. Because I'm not going to lie. Like, Oso is a great player, but he's his own enemy. You know what I'm saying? Look at that. We get up another hash three. Like, we're messing up. We're messing up. 
the point guard is showing that he can dot too, and that that was that's something he didn't do really the first game. The first game he wasn't passing as much, and this game they forced our point guard to pass. You heard that they like I said they went from playing high low to straight sit up sides and sides. You, you're not getting off a side as a point guard. Um, not if you're playing against people that's playing good sides. Like they're they're playing a tight side. Just so there's nothing I can do but slip and get the easy layup or dunk. Cause trust me, like I said, they don't want clutch to go stupid. I don't blame them. The man's a monster, bro. Like the the man's the, he's disgusting right there. They give another three right there, but like I said in our last game, bro. Clutch controllers messed up. Oso's controller messed up. And somehow I don't know why when he shoots the ball. That time my button gets pressed every time. So we like, bro, I'm telling Clutch, bro, we, we, we might well blow these timeouts right now, bro. Like, cause honestly, <laughs> nigga, you do that in a game winning shot, bro. Like, we, 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 we gonna scrap, you feel me? But yeah, uh, we're gonna waste all our timeouts right there. And it's tough right now. I ain't gonna lie, like, cause the problem with wasting all your timeouts, what if we need it? You know what I'm saying? But we gotta live with that. So we all playing with handicaps. When all of our controls are messed up. We just playing the game, right? I get the slip. He dots also also doesn't go with that one. Also hits back to, to Josh at the top. My best ranger. Um, I get the board. I said board. I get the cut. He throws it up right there. I'm like, all right, man. I'm trying to tell the guys, hey guys, at this point, I'm not gonna lie. In the last couple of seconds of the shot clock, none of y'all need to get cold. I'm a pick and roll center. Like, bro, you don't. None of y'all have to ever get y'all some situation y'all can be cold. Just give me the ball. I'll take the dumb shot. You know what I'm saying? That's just the smart thing to do. Like, I'm, either way, it's going to be easy for me to get uncold. And right there, I'm, I'm doing my best to let the point guard. I want the point guard to actually dot the person in the corner, but he's not going to do it. Uh, what they were doing is, I'm not going to lie, like, I, I, this whole game, they were like straight up telling the, the dude to go back door on me. So I, I was playing him too close and he has 99 speed. That's a stupid move. Um, he's a two way finish. He's not going to shoot like that, like in my face that fast. So like I'm playing too close. He, he's going to cut, he's going to back door me and line this game. And my team was like, God damn gas. Like you, bro, you got to stop letting him get them back doors. And like, it, it was tough, bro. It was tough right there. See, that's an adjustment I made. Cause they were pressing, they were pressing, clutch at the top of the, um, the top of the court like early. It, it was annoying. So I pretty much, I really he uh, see he could have pulled that shot, but he didn't pull it. Um, he ended up seeing it later on in the game that then I could have pulled that. Now right there, pretty much I'm trying to go back door again. They're they're on me right there. They're they're trying to definitely uh, get a stop, get a stop right there for them. Um, feet to the feet right now. Crucial moments. I'm like, all right. Uh, also, he shoots that shot. He misses it. I'm like, damn. All right. I'm like, next time, just give me the ball. Like, if anything, I'll force it up and hopefully I get fouled. They shoot a midi. They make it. I'm like, damn, bro. It's looking real bad. And, you know what I'm saying? You don't say these things out loud, but you're saying it in your head. Like, damn, bro. Like, but you keep that mindset that, bro, we're, we're going to, we're still in this game. We got it. Now, right there, also gets the back door. Like I said, Clutch is definitely in point guard mode like like i said they play they're playing tougher defense than ever was they were full court pressing them with two locks bro like two legend locks night not, not even you know what i'm saying two legend locks like some of y'all can't some of y'all can't even go against one legend lock some of y'all can't even go against an officer threat <laughs> but he's dealing with two legend locks you know what i'm saying that's tough, bro. Like, you gotta understand. This beat, they have extra badges, badges. You feel me? Like, 30, 40 badges each. You feel me? That is crazy. So, you dealing with that. So, right there, we get to stay right there. Come on. So I'm saying, also was making mistakes shooting the ball. But when it came to, when it came to defense, the man got so much stops right there. I get the easy vert lob. That's just being smart. There's no reason for me to come back up. The point guard is already getting trapped at half court anyway. So just stay down, get the lob. That's just being that's having big smart man IQ right there. That's just, just being smart there. At this point, I have 20, I have doubled my points plus five at this point. Remember, I scored 10 points in the first game alone. Right there, he crabs also, he shoots it and breaks it. Now, I'm not gonna lie, if he makes that shot, that's huge for them. You know what I'm saying? That, that would have actually crushed us. We'll be down by one right now if he made that shot. And what we're very fortunate he missed that shot. But man, look at this. This is crazy. 
Like that, he, he, he goes around the basket. He hits this crazy layup. We all like, all right, no matter what, y'all just give that up. We don't hedge off nothing. Don't give him no threes because he's actually been passing the ball this game. And right here, Clutch driven up the court. Clutch, like, I should have stayed up a little longer. We talked about this later in the game. Like, bro, I kept cutting. I kept cutting too much. I like, bro, should I just leave him there up there with the lock? Should I leave him? Then I cut. Also takes that shot and breaks it. They get the ball, throws it down court. And oh my God, someone calls timeout by mistake. <laughs> oh, shit. I know y'all mad. But yeah, still, um, someone calls timeout. Like, pretty much like they were spamming X, bro. And, and they got the ball and called timeout and ruined it. They could have gained. They, that could have, that should have been game right there. I'm not going to lie. Um, if anything, he would have got fouled. Right there, we, it's tip off time. They get um they get the tip off, and at this point, we're in overtime. Like th this should never happen. He shoots that shot and breaks it. Now if he makes that shot, you guys are that, that would have hurt. You know what I'm saying? Three pointers hurt. You know what I'm saying? So at this point, I'm just hedging a little bit. He's over that. He breaks it, and I'm like, all right, cool. We're in a good spot. Come on, bro. 58 to 56. Everything looking great right now. I'm not gonna lie that. We just gotta stop early in the game. On um, good defense by Pitt and also just great, great communication. Those two, they like, pretty much, uh, pretty much Pitt knows that. All right, bro. Um, if he gets past also, I got the full commit. Just shut it down right there. All right, all right. Then he goes baseline and gets the contact dunk. That is crazy. Um. For him to be a playmaker doing that stuff, like, you see his stats are way better this game, 23 and 14. The last game they played, he didn't he didn't play that good. I, I just seen it um, today. I was like, whoa, bro, you was like 8 for 17. That's tough. But, yeah, like I said, um, on Surreal stuff, I'm going to put the link in the description um, to his channel if you guys want to sub to him. Like I said, he streams uh, stage and everything. Y'all can go check him out. Um... Also, I'm gonna put the link in the description for for Clutch too. I'm tripping. Clutch, Clutch, um, stream. He been streaming a little bit. Y'all go check out Clutch, man. Um, Clutch, the point guard I play with. Um, you guys already know. Also, and Pig. Come on, bro. Of course, that, that, that's that's little bros right there. You know what I'm saying? You guys already know. Um, but yeah, definitely, I'm gonna put that links in the description. Uh, Y'all go check them out, bro. I support our I support our pro am players, and yeah, bro. Right there, we get the easy. Oh man, we got the crazy good Clutch there, right there. Now, right there, Clutch goes, <laughs> Clutch does the spin back, and oh my god, Ranger hasn't taken a shot all game, y'all. I'm talking the whole game, Ranger hasn't taken one shot because they don't hedge off the hash at all. And we get our first green for Ranger. Like, Ranger only greened one shot in our last game, and he greens his first and only shot of the game. That was huge. Shout out to Ranger. You know what I'm saying? Ranger was the big shot. And at this point, I'm like, bro, like, we should kill clock. But I'm like, all right, I'm cut down to the basket. I get the lob. 27.6 rebounds at this point. I'm the leading scorer of the game right now. Like, it's, it's crazy. Um, we're just doing our, we're pretty much telling, hey, no matter what, everybody, everybody stay home. Stay home. Let them get that dunk. Oh, well. Like, that's just two points. You might as well give them two and not three. You know what I'm saying? Um, right there, I'm, I'm messing up. I almost do a turnover right there. Now that I see it, it's tough right there. He, God's playing way more better than me. 25 points and 15 assists. Like, all right, um, I know if anything, I got the easy cut. And he is me. I get the lob. Come on, man. 29 points at this point, y'all. That is plus 19 from last game. Like I said, they made their adjustment was to make sure Clutch did not do what he did last game. So yeah, I think as a lockdown's pride, bro, you don't want the point guard to kill you, bro. The point guard, the point, if the point guard have a good day, <laughs> that means the whole <clears throat> the team's gonna blame you for losing. I'm gonna be real with you. <clears throat> they're gonna point at the point that they, they point at the fact that the point guard went stupid on you. You know what I'm saying? Nobody wants that. As a lockdown, like being a defender, that's your pride, bro. You don't want that. But man, look at that, y'all. 63 to 67. We're happy. We need. We we got the W. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody who watched the video this long. Um, this is extremely long, extremely long voiceover. But um, we made it through, man. Appreciate you guys rocking me. To my favorite, anybody in the video that's watching me right now, that's watching, 
Do me a favor, hit that like button to sub on turn post notifications. If you're new, I'm gonna be doing my best to upload every day if I can. Um, we grinding, man. Um, I'm still gonna try to hit 10k subs. I know I said that in my last video. I'm trying to hit 10k before the end of this year. It's what it is, man. Um, more pro and videos coming. Um, we got a matchup tonight. I'm gonna be editing that video once we're done with that matchup. Appreciate you guys rocking me so much, man. Hell yeah, and I got my 99 over on now, so I'm even faster, I'm even stronger, I'm even better. Spud Cut TV, appreciate you guys rocking me. Let's go, man.